In the previous two videos, on our Windows 10 Home 64-bit machine, we installed the Windows Terminal and then we installed PowerShell 7. But we noticed that when we click to open the terminal, it opens in the old Windows PowerShell and we want PowerShell 7 to open and not have to go through this every time. Well, besides that, we also notice that it does not open as administrator and so in order for that to happen well let's get that to close in order for that to happen we would have to open the terminal as administrator and then go through all of that well let's make that a little bit easier so here I am well actually let's go back to the original one so here I am in my terminal window what I'm going to do is click on the down arrow and I'm going to go down to settings. Here in settings under the startup tab I have this thing called default profile right over here default profile and this is what opens when I open the terminal and I have Windows PowerShell so let's switch that to just PowerShell. Now if yours says PowerShell 7 fine otherwise just use PowerShell. The other thing I want to do is go down here to defaults and then you see run this profile as administrator. I'm going to turn that on. I'll save those and then I'll close that window. And now when I open the terminal you'll see it asks me the user account control. I'll say yes and it will now open PowerShell 7.3 as an administrator without any more fuss. Very handy.